difference. It's about getting all your reps in and using strict form and not throwing around a lot of weight. The first exercise is the bent over row. It's important when doing the bent over row you keep a nice flat back and execute good form. The second exercise in the grappling circuit is an upright row. You want to have a nice close grip and pull the bar all the way up under your chin. Again it's important to use a weight that you can work with so that you're not straining and you can get all your reps in. By the end of the sixth set, it doesn't matter what the weight is, you're going to be tired. The third exercise in the grappling circuit is the military press. The military press in front of your face works that shoulder region, one of the major areas when you're grappling and punching. It's a very important exercise and again you want to use strict form so that you don't hurt your lower back. Fourth exercise in the grappling circuit is a good morning. You want to work your lower back and keep strict form, keep a nice flat back and really isolate those spinal erectors. Fifth and sixth exercise in the grappling circuit is a split squat left and a split squat right. You're going to do eight repetitions on each side. You want to make sure and keep your head up and stick your chest out. This develops all those stabilizing muscles that you use when you're changing levels and penetrating to take somebody down. I can't emphasize enough that this grappling circuit's not about using heavy weight. It's about using weight you can manage and getting a lot of reps in. The seventh exercise in the grappling circuit is the most difficult exercise. It's a two-part exercise. You're going to squat, you're going to readjust your feet, and do a push press. It's very important on the push press that you don't use your arms to throw the bar up, but you buck the bar with your hips and catch the bar with your hands. It's the hardest exercise because you have to explode twice to get through this exercise. Nice good deep squat with good form and a nice explosion at the top for the push press. The last exercise in the grappling circuit is a straight legged deadlift. It's important again to keep a good form so you don't injure your lower back. Nice shoulder roll at the top, the bar coming down just below your knees. This is the end of the first set. You want to do six sets of this grappling circuit with 60 seconds rest in between each set. Make sure you get all your reps and you don't put the bar down until you're done.